Hello happy people, this is your host Crypto Puffy and welcome to our today's show. If you have been following our series of videos on Star Atlas, then you definitely know that it's a project that is upgrading the online gaming experience. In particular, the outstanding aspect of their game economics is the ability to cash out on earnings made from playing the online game. Star Atlas also provides an NFT marketplace for direct peer-to-peer -peer exchange of assets an on-chain governance model, as well as Play for Keys gameplay. If you missed the intro video on Star Atlas, then please follow the link that has popped up at the top right of your screen to understand the basic of the project. Now, in this video, we are going to look at the step-by-step -step process of buying the meta posters. We may have explained what the posters are and their benefits, but let us now guide you on the journey to access all these gems and hence participate in the pre-launch of Star Atlas. Be sure to watch this until the very end, especially if you wish to understand all the details relating to the rebirth meta posters and the step-by-step -step process of making the purchase. Be sure to subscribe to our channel and press the bell icon so that you will always be notified about new updates we post on Star Atlas. Also, before we jump into the video, please note that the content here is meant for education and entertainment purposes only and is not to be used as financial advice. Your capital may be at risk, so make sure you check with your financial advisor. With that being said, let's go to the video. So Star Atlas is a massively multiplayer online metaverse that seeks to introduce a unique gaming experience by harnessing the power of traditional core game and blockchain mechanics. In our previous video on Star Atlas, which was a very crucial update, we announced their introduction of Rebirth, a new way for their community members to participate in the pre-launch of the project through the sale of 14 open edition multimedia meta posters. If you missed this update, a link will be popping up on the top right of your screen any second, but let's do a quick recap. Rebirth is a one-of-a-kind poster sale that combines ultra-high definition digital art AR, and custom audioscapes into unique works of tradable artwork. Once purchased, Posters are to be minted into resaleable NFTs available throughout the Star Atlas Metaverse. New editions are released each Saturday, effective April 24th, and will continue for 14 consecutive weeks. During this period, you have the opportunity to add a new NFT to your reward collection for every week that you buy a Meta poster. This will continue until the final weeks, when you will be able to buy the top tier 5 posters. An interesting twist that Star Atlas made to spice things up and build curiosity is that for you to pick up the final posters, which will be completely free on the 14th week and complete the full series, you will have to prove you, you've acquired all other 13 posters. Also, each of these 14 posters bears its own unique and immersive augmented reality experience using sounds and visuals to create mood-altering effects. They will guarantee you a full audio and visual experience that moves in all directions and most interestingly, if you combine other posters of the same tier, you will get access to unique, one-of-a-kind and in-game rewards. That's pretty amazing, isn't it? Are you enjoying the video so far and getting value from it? If yes, then please hit that like button and subscribe if you haven't done so already. Don't forget to press the bell icon so that you will always be notified about our newest videos. And just in case you are new here, our channel is your home of all amazing facts and latest developments in the world of cryptocurrencies. Now let's go back to the video. Now let's move to the actual process in which you are going to see the steps to follow when buying a meta poster. It is important to make sure that you have a wallet installed on your device and that it, that it is sufficiently funded depending on the number of meta posters you hope to buy and the price for each of them. Once your wallet is installed, you need to access the reboard portal of Star Atlas where you will find all the media and events. The easiest way is to click on the reboard event on the top right of the main website, which is a green button. You could also Google search play.staratlas.com just in case you don't want to use the long route through the, throughout the main website. This will also get you to the portal. Here, you will click on the rebirth event where you will see the actual meta posters that you can buy. On your right, you will see all the meta posters, both the ones already released as well as the ones that are yet to be made available for sale. 
Each meta poster has a date on it, as well as a tag showing the reward level. The first step here is to connect to your wallet, which you'll be able to do by pressing the connect wallet button below the wallet requires section. There are different wallets that you can use. We have used Solong Wallet and Phantom Wallet, both which are recommended by the Star Atlas team and have a lot of features that would be made available for Solana users. Once you do this, you will get a pop-up with various wallet options and you will obviously connect to the one matching your existing wallet. For example, for our Phantom wallet, we will simply press on Phantom at the bottom of the pop-up message and immediately you notice it changed to disconnect, which shows that we are now connected. You will immediately get the confirmation, after which you can close the pop-up message. Please note that if you had a wallet already, then the button will read reconnect when you need to use your wallet because you were already connected before. Once you are connected with the wallet, you can now proceed to the MetaPoster you wish to buy and choose to buy from the marketplace. Then click on the specific posters you wish to buy and you are going to see the price on the secondary market and details of the poster. You can choose to buy at this price or click on the actual MetaPoster and buy directly from the company. Please make sure you have sufficient funds for the MetaPoster in your wallet before buying it. You will see the full description of the MetaPoster including the rewards, special feature, features, etc. You could decide to view the full experience for example in 3D, which will allow you to preview the MetaPoster. There will be a QR code to scan and you will definitely need to use an iPhone or tablet to scan it by following the scanning, scanning instructions. If you choose instead to view the experience on your computer, you will notice that you can only view the experience in 2D. So let us now buy the first meta poster to demonstrate what we are talking about so far. First, we'll click on the buy button and a message will pop up prompting us to confirm the transaction with our wallet provider. The wallet will display a message prompting us to either approve or cancel the transaction. Once we approve, we will get a notification that the trade has been completed. In our case, we have both the ARBs from Forever meta posters, and in order to view it, we will go to the inventory section. Please note that you might get a notification that no Star Atlas item is found in your wallet, probably because we just made the purchase and it will take some time to show it. The best thing is to wait patiently as it may take a few minutes. As you wait, one way of confirming that the sale actually took place is by checking the balance on your wallet. If the balance has reduced by the amount of the poster sale, then the sale definitely went through. If your wallet balance is still the same, you may want to confirm that you follow the process correctly and try again. In our case, the balance is less, so the sale definitely went through. As we wait for the newly purchased meta poster, we can switch to a different wallet address to see how the items we just purchased some days ago is likely to appear. So for example, moving to Solon wallet, we can see two previously purchased posters, Discovery of Iris, which was the first in the series, and the Heart of Star Atlas, which were purchased before this video. This is how we expect the new Armstrong Forever poster that we just bought to appear. When the poster finally appears, you will need to claim it. This is a very necessary step and will also prompt you to approve transactions like before. You will get a notification that the transaction was successful and the inventory is being processed. Once this is completed, the item will now appear in your inventory section together with an any other items bought so far. Please note that even after claiming it, the item can take a few more minutes to appear on your inventory, so be patient. It may be hard to disconnect from your wallet and reconnect again, just in case the delays are caused by your connection. If you are patient enough, the newly purchased meta poster will appear in your inventory and once you view the item, you will see all the relevant information and description of the specific issue that you bought. It will now be in your wallet and you have the power to do whatever you please with it. And of course, you will follow these steps to buy all other meta posters in the future. Important is to always confirm that the purchase went through and that each newly acquired poster is received into your inventory. Remember, as we mentioned earlier, for you to get the last meta posters for free, Star Atlas will require these items in your inventory as evidence that you already bought the other 13 meta posters. That's all we had for today and I hope you enjoyed it. Please be sure to like the video if you got value from it. Make sure you subscribe 
and click the bell button so you never miss any of our videos in the future. Until next time, cheers guys, bye bye!